is the blue guys pretty much uh, so this is the next one in terms of uh, chronological order when they begin so I decided just to go for the, uh, in this order so Wu is going to be the last of the first three and uh, yeah I think we we always get a cutscene here at the start and I'm gonna have to start a new game I'm playing on normal once again even though I have cleared this already some of my characters may have been leveled up um, so I, I, I don't think it'll be drastic enough for me to put it on hard, but we'll see. So anyway, well, yeah, let's uh, let's start this now. All right, we start with this. Okay. So I believe the first uh, the first uh, map here that we are actually running away, as I recall, I forget the name of the actual map, but whatever. So it's not the Yellow Turban Rebellion, which generally all the factions sort of started with, at least in 7, every uh, Wu, Wei and uh, Shu were all in Yellow Turban Rebellion at the start of their campaign, so I guess they changed it up, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I guess playing the same scenario three times would probably not be the best way to start out anyway. Because there probably is going to be some reused battles, uh, mostly against Shu I would imagine. Uh, but, you know, since generally they don't do too many maps, but at least we'll be from a different side, <laughs> mirrored or something like that. So, yeah, I'm pretty... Oh, I remember this map. Didn't we just uh, almost play that? Or we did a... It was one of the later few maps. Yeah, we did. But they're going to use it here as well. Uh, we are just running away anyway. Uh, I don't really know who to use here. Okay, so first of all, we haven't really got a bit of an introduction of who these people are. This is Sao Sao. We already know him from the Shu campaign. He is the leader of Wei, basically, um, even though it's not Wei right now. He's pretty much the main character of Wei, more or less. Alright, we also have Zhao Yuan. It might not be that. Uh, he is a cheery guy. Uh, and he uses a mace bow. Seriously, it's a mace bow. I will, I'll probably play him just to show the mace bow. And this is Zhao Dun. He's pretty popular. Uh, pretty popular character for this game. He, he's usually on promotion stuff and that. But uh, yeah, he just has a giant ass sword. And eventually he gets his eye shot out by an arrow. I don't think they show that in this game, but uh, they did in 7. They do occasionally show it. Alright, so I'll play as this guy. Um, he does have a... What's it? Bow and Rod. That is what they call it. Alright, so my guys might be a bit higher level than usual. And this should be um, Zhao Dun's sword here. Uh, so I'll use that as well. And it just seems like I keep using these same sort of um, skills, honestly. Wow, health boost 20. Jesus. You know what? I'll keep that on. Why not? Alright, let's do this. I've been waiting for a chance to show what I can do. Cao Cao. I don't know who put you up to this, but you were mad to think you could kill me. Ha! You pathetic worm. Only those who wield true strength can claim any stake in this land of chaos. Ah. Strength, you say? <sighs> then know this. It is with just such strength that one day I shall strike you down.
think he's okay? It'll take more than what's in there to kill our lord. Oh! Ah, looks like it didn't go so well. See, this is what happens. For now, we run until I have strength, until our time comes. Some funky camera there, but uh, yeah. Uh, so, once again, we're actually fighting Lu Bu. Well, we're not, we're not going to be fighting him um, in this first scenario. Now, I believe. Do not pursue Lu Bu! You gotta remember that. Trust me. He kind of stays back at the start, a little bit at least. Now, I believe the o there is an optional objective here, and it is to um, basically um, just kill him on this scenario. Though you don't actually kill him. Or at least I believe that's what you have to do. Uh, I may have already completed some of the optional uh, objectives because I have already played this before. But uh, it shouldn't be that big a deal. I'll just go and probably do them again or something. Alright, so all you've really got to do in this first scenario is relatively short and relatively small map as well. But yeah, this is his bow. Uh, he is not as high level. He's only level 1, so they actually start out with that. His, uh, his special is very easy to do though. It's just triangle twice and it's pretty good. AoE stuff at least. Alright. But yes, it's seriously a mace bow. <laughs> Something like that, I guess. Alright, so... You've just got to run away this entire time. It's not that difficult, even though you do have Lubu <laughs> chasing you. He will kill you in like one or two hits, so do not start... <laughs> just do not st stay around, because uh, yeah, you're gonna die. There's nothing really to stop for here, so I just want to focus on taking out the generals, basically. Which is not that difficult, because these guys are level 1, so... Yeah, of course there is that. Is that really the health boost? This game? I still don't have that much health, honestly. And I need to uh, actually maybe go and sell some of these weapons, because you actually do have a limit on the weapons at 15 per weapon, I believe. So... Maybe next time when I go into the blacksmith, I believe, uh, when I get a chance, I'll go and sell them. I won't show you sell. I won't show myself selling them because that would just be boring. But uh, yeah, like some of the weapons, I already have enough um, enough of them, so I can sell some of the more useless ones, at least, uh, which I kind of forgot to do. There's also the other mode, ambition mode, which I really haven't touched at all. I actually haven't touched it at all now. So, of course, there is that as well, where you can get other stuff. It's kind of more of a free mode. Oh yeah, I remember this part, right. These boss that will not, uh, will not stop until you kill this guy right here, so... I like to kill him quickly. <laughs> there we go. I don't know if they'll still fire, but... We'll see. Oh no, there is someone else. Alright. Oh, it's you. God damn it. Right, I'm just going for this, then. There we go. Forgot it was the uh, other guy I need to take out. Huh, when you're in rage mode, they don't knock you back. That's pretty cool. Right, there we go. Well, that's that's fine. Fucking ballista. They always annoy me, so, yeah. That guy just hit Peasants hitting me? What? What is this? It's seriously, I, I just can't get over some of these weapons, sorry. It's too good. Alright, so, yeah, that was pretty much, I think Wu Bu actually might stop uh, chasing you for now, at this point. Where's the rest of you? Oh, you're around the corner, okay. Oh no, you went over here, okay. I was wondering where where he went, but uh, okay. Yep, seems good. All right. Uh, 
and we'll do this again. Is this a uh, Jardin sword? I don't actually know. Sorry, I'm terrible with remembering weapons at this game. Uh, I usually just remember the names. Even though I can't pronounce them. But, uh, you know, at least there's that. Was that Zhao Chan? Hmm. I don't think it was. Uh, I can't really hear my TV, unfortunately, while I have the headset on, but you know. Okay, so basically at this point you just need to follow her. And yes, this is one of the other characters that generally does not do that much in the games, and she has a whip as a weapon, so... Yeah. Of course, never actually done any uh, fights in history, of course. Just like many of the females in this game, apart from like, one. Pretty sure it's just one. But whatever, we need male to female, even though the ratio is fucked. Pretty much. I guess. I guess, Koi. You, you win this one, I guess. Alright. Yeah, cheers. Just open the gate. So, I'm, I may actually do a few more, or try to get a few more uh, Wii maps, because they don't generally take that long, and I was just kind of lazy before and only recorded uh, one per day or such. This one is really short, honestly. This is pretty much the end. As I recall, so yeah, it's not really going to take that much uh, more. Uh, okay, that worked, I guess. So yeah, the, all you got to take out is this guy, who we remember, I'm sure. As we had to take him out a bunch of the shoe. Seriously. So, oh, come on. Alright, fine, do your grapple. Do your grapple, fine. It's alright. There we go. And you're dead. Twin axes, though. And all you need to do is just get over here. Uh, I think they'll lower this bridge. Is it a bridge? It might be a gate. Can't even tell what it is. It's a bridge. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I remember this section of the map at least. Um, I think they took other parts, though. But, uh, yeah. And there we go, and we get a victory! A victory, yes. A victory. Alright. I guess we don't get a cutscene at the end of that. Okay, so... I believe this was, uh... The point where, um... Basically, a lot of the, a lot of yeah, Yuan Shao, and a lot of others, I believe, wanted to take out Dong Zhua because he was pretty much an asshole, more or less. But of course, he did have Lu Bu uh, under his command, so yeah, that kind of stopped people from uh, messing with him generally. But yeah, of course, uh, we we. Uh, um, Liu Bei and um, Sun Jian actually join in this t th this time. I believe we'll see some of them. All right, so yeah, this 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 should just be the Battle of Hulao Gate, which we should have played already. As Shu, so it's going to be a little bit repetitive, but it shouldn't be that bad, I would imagine. Okay, so Zhao Dun is probably going to be in a lot of the <laughs> these maps, honestly, he'll... yeah. Okay, well, I could play as the other two as well. Uh, I'll probably go for Zhao Dun this time, just because he's, he's... He's a fairly cool character, at least. Wei is actually my favorite uh, of the three. I, I couldn't specifically tell you why, but uh, I know it's not Xu, <laughs> at least. But uh, yeah, that's the end of this map, so I'll see you guys next time.